All right, you're watching DefenseReview.com, and I'm here with Logan Harris of Spotter RF, and Logan is going to take us through this backpackable uh, backpack kit. It's backpack a radar kit. backpack kit. Radar backpack kit. So okay, it's there something we go. that in 20 pounds you get 300 acres of coverage. So okay. why this is important is that and this is radar. This, this is, is radar. This know, is a GMTI motion tracking radar system. Right. So instead of like a ground surveillance radar that weighs 100 pounds, takes an 80 foot tower, right. you put that type of capability into a backpack. So everything you need is right here. Two radars, a tripod, hub, battery pack, all of this is something that weighs 20 pounds. So you Got can it. take this out in a very remote, austere location right. and use it. And why, why that really matters is where I want to show you on this uh, little video clip is that, as you can see here, if you have just a camera by yourself, let's go back here. Um, if you have a camera by yourself, it's very hard to find what you need to look at. You get big areas, it's hard to see. This is like a HD uh, camera looking out. There's a person walking out in there. Okay. Now your job is to find that person. Right. And visually it's hard. Visually. It's very hard now. That's what you're at. At night, you just have your night vision That's why goggles you want radar. On. That's why you want radar, to tell you where to look. Because your time is ticking, he's getting closer, he's got an RPG, or he's got an AK-47, he's gonna get you. He's in there. You know he's in there, but you right. can't find him with just just the camera. So whether it's IR or so, whether can we see what the radar would show? Exactly. So we're going to see that here in a second. And uh, so after two minutes and 31 seconds, you still haven't seen him. He's going to pop out. We're going to put a little track on him. I see him. I can see you him visually. Him. I can yep. see him. He's right there. There he is. You got him. So. Two hours and I mean two hours, two minutes and forty. But the radar seconds. just kicked in, and so well, now no, you got no, this is this is just highlighting it. Okay. We're gonna, now we're going to show you using the radar. Okay. So it's going to start at the exact same spot, out uh, four hundred meters approximately, starting out, and then boom, there's the radar hit right there. So the radar shows it on uh, Google Earth or their map display. Cue your camera. And, and then, and, oh, and it circles him. Does it? Does the radar do this? No, the situational awareness software does that. Okay. So no, no, right, the, right, right. But the situational, it's combined with the radar. Yes. So, so this is what you'll see on your screen. The circle will go around the guy. In some applications. In some so, applications. Yeah. So that depends on the situational awareness package that works with it. Okay. We did this to illustrate um, why you have radar to cue your camera. Okay. Because camera by itself. You got a so wide the, area. So cue the camera, and, the, and then the camera zooms in. And then you can zoom in, identify your target, take the appropriate action. That's why you need radar. Got you. That's it. All right. Well, uh, very cool. Now, and, and obviously, very important for perimeter security. Yes. To have something like this. Yes. Force protection. Because the sooner you can identify the threat, the sooner you can engage the threat or, exactly. or, or deal with the threat. Exactly. And if that person is carrying an R, you know, RPG or AK-47, you'd li rather know where he's at when he's out at 500 meters or f a thousand meters than 100 meters away. And right. That's the difference with the with just the camera alone. Right. He can be 100 meters away before you pick him up. Because time is life. Yes. How All much right. is that worth? Right. All right. Thank you, Logan. Yes. Really appreciate it. Spotter RF. DefenseReview.com.